I am really going to miss this show when it's over. Hey everyone, Jeremy here. Today I'm about to watch the season finale of Hawkeye, so this is Christmas. Yeah, I cannot believe how much I actually enjoyed this show. I, If you'd have told me at the end of the year, or actually I guess beginning of the year, that at the end of the year, Hawkeye would be bucking for your favorite MCU show, I'd say you're crazy, but for some reason this show has just landed for me so well. I mean, don't get me wrong, I absolutely love the other shows. I mean, Loki, oh, I, Falcon and the Winter Soldier, WandaVision, I mean, adore those shows. But there is just something about this show that is just, it, it's just tickling my funny bone left, right, and center. That's in no small part to the two leads, uh, Hawkeye, uh, Clint, and uh, Kate. They are cracking me up the way they play off of each other. It's a buddy cop show. And I, I don't think I was quite prepared for it. I, I kind of thought that's what we were looking at, but I had no idea. Wow. I, I just love this show. I can't wait to see what happens this week, especially after that reveal last week. Oh, we're just gonna start with him? <laughs> what? There are no lines in this business. And that is why I have to leave this business. Eleanor, don't be rash. I want you oh. to Oh, no. I have been keeping an insurance policy. Uh, you just killed yourself. I don't need a minute. Oh, they have the same thing. Elena, you should go home. You should be with your family. You can still make it in time for Christmas. Kate, you're my partner. Your mess is my mess. That awesome. Awesome. The people need to be reminded that the city belongs to me. Oh boy. Oh boy. I love how menacing he is already. He's just terrifying. We need a ton of gear. Like a whole batch of way too dangerous trick arrows. You can make more. Yes. What is this one? <laughs> She's labeling them so she can tell what they are. That's awesome. Love it. What are you? I I, I cannot wait to see these in action. When I was younger, aliens invaded. Hmm. Then I saw you fighting aliens with a stick and a. <laughs> You showed me that being a hero isn't just for people who can fly or shoot lasers out of their hands. It's for anyone who is brave enough to do what's right, no matter the cost. Wow. It's got a little warm. I don't see my mom yet. Why don't you tell me what you do see? Oh. Oh! Wow, Jack's out of jail already. Just out of jail for allegedly murdering somebody with one. Maybe it's his way of proving that he really is innocent. It's a weird flux, but. <laughs> hey, Jack, I thought you were in jail. Get down. Oh! Oh! I feel like I'm missing something here. Okay, Jack is completely oblivious to what's going on. Is it? It's your time. Oh, Jack. So I know you're chummy with my mom, but I gotta say, I didn't think you'd make the cut for the Christmas mm. party. Kate Bishop. I'm not here to ruin anything. I'm just going to kill Barton, have some appetizers, and then we'll go. Well, I hope you enjoyed the bruschetta because it looks like you already lost him. He's in the elevator. Well, yeah, but what, out of 65 floors, you think you're just gonna magically guess which one he's on? 12th floor. Enjoy the party. No, no, Kate, stay. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. Oh, my God, what is happening? <laughs> 
Did you plan that? Yes. No, no. I... <laughs> oh, I'm, uh, I'm gonna need to see these two partnered up in a movie or something now. Clint! Is that you? <sighs> it's Elena! Watch out! H. Oh, that's just falling. That's just falling. That's that's. Oh. I know it's probably not the best moment right now, but I want to thank you, you know, for your advice, what you said, how I should speak to my girlfriend. Did it work? It worked, bro. I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Jack. Hello, sweetie. Goodbye, you. I love Jack, it. Jack, I am. I am so sorry. My mom got you put in jail. Are you okay? Never been better. Oh no! <laughs> Jack's helping. Yes. I knew the sword had to come into play, but <laughs> I didn't know how. Oh. Oh, he's, he's in the tree. He's in the tree. <laughs> he's on our side, but we should probably get him out of here too. <laughs> yeah, Jack's gonna get himself killed. Hey guys, I think it's time. I mean, we're trained professionals, but that's not enough right now. Let's go. They're putting on their gear. Cage, where's our backup? Yep. <laughs> We're all gonna die. <laughs> I'm gonna get out myself. You want me to stay on my signal or no? Cage, please don't do anything. Oh no, she's bringing the tree down. Cage, what just happened? Oh, she's bringing down the tree. Oh no, Kate! In all my years watching movies and TV, I've never seen someone take down <laughs> the pocket full of Oh Whoa! these. No way. Is it time? It's time. She's earned her trick arrows. Oh! Oh no! Okay, okay. They're practically mirroring each other. <laughs> what happens to them now? I don't know. I'll have to ask Scott about that one. <laughs> <gasps> oh no! Well, there's that. We have to find Kate, and I think she. <gasps> oh! What are you gonna do with that? Oh! What? Oh, crap. Oh. So this version of Kingpin is pretty much superhuman. Yeah. Mind your own business. Oh, no. Not the tree arrows. Oh, no. Oh, 
Okay, we've definitely established he is superhuman in this one. Your secret whistle with Nat. She talked about you all the time, Elena. When did she say? <laughs> you told me about how you got separated as kids. She loved you. And always wanted you safe. <laughs> I loved her so much. Me too. Oh. Sometimes family doesn't see eye to eye. Okay, there's no way he's dead. There's just no way he's dead. Pretty handy with that thing. Have you ever heard of LARPing? LARPing? Is that some sort of leisure activity? <laughs> I, I desperately want to see him LARP. Hey, are you sure this is okay? Oh, I'm telling you, you're very excited to meet you. Brought <laughs> 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 up a couple strays. <laughs> <laughs> this is Kate. Welcome, Kate. I'm so good to have you. Thank you. Yeah, knew it was hers. Yeah, I, there was too much pointing to the fact that she was an agent. She's got to be like Mockingbird. So should I say a few words or? What do you think of Lady Hawk? Oh, yeah, that's terrible. Lady Hawk. Hawk Eve? No, worse. Hawk shot. Like hot, like hot shot, but, but you know, hot. No. You know what? Actually, I have an idea. Oh, what is it? strange in the air today. The sun is gone red and Tell me there's like an hour of this. Okay, I was kidding about an hour of this. I was really kidding. This is going to keep going, isn't it? Okay, and that was Hawkeye Season 1, and hopefully we're- I, I really want us to get a Season 2 now. I freaking loved this show. Um, a couple of things. I, I guess this version of Kingpin, because I assume the Daredevil show is going to stay almost in its own universe, but the characters are going to have their own versions here, which just played by the same actors. That's fine to me. Um, I mainly just want the actors back. I, I love Daredevil, and I love Punisher, but if I have to make a choice, I'll take the actors back because the actors are incredible. Uh, but this does seem to be a super powered kingpin, more like the comic book kingpin, who is incredibly hard to kill to a degree. Got super strength, a minor degree, not Hulk like, like we saw here. And actually, he was pretty strong in Daredevil as well. Don't don't get me wrong, he was very strong in that. But this was to a different level. It seemed like, and and he wasn't invincible like he seems to be in this one where. You could shoot him, hit him with a car, uh, and he's not going to die. That that's a, that's a new take on Kingpin, as far as I'm concerned. At least compared to Daredevil, anyway. It's more comic accurate, but not Daredevil. Netflix accurate. And what they've done with Elena, her and Kate's scenes together are freaking magic. I cannot wait to see them team up again. If they want to do a season two and it brings her in as a main character, please do. Please do. You can have all three, Clint... 
Kate and Yelena, and I'd be extremely excited for that. That would be incredible, because those two playing off each other is hysterical. In fact, you could just make it about those two, and I'd be fine with it if, if they want to retire Clint, who Clint really wants to retire, <laughs> but he keeps getting sucked back in. The one character that didn't really land that well for me, and it's not that they were bad, it's just not someone I'm going to think about much after the show is over, is Echo liked her as a foil in this but she didn't really stand out to me at all not like Yelena did not like Kate did and the fact that she's getting her own spin-off is kind of odd I mean it, it's just one of those things where I could have understood if she was a breakout character like everybody's just talking about Echo after the show's over then I'd see Marvel going yes and we're gonna do a spin-off about her but we're I don't know that people are going to I didn't think that much of her maybe I'm wrong maybe you guys loved her and thought she was incredible in the show I'm not talking about the comic book version I'm talking about in this show I, I don't feel like she was a standout oh and I desperately need an entire series make it just four episodes but I'll watch every single one of Jack as a LARPer please please just you know four half hour episodes of Jack LARPing I, I, I'd, I'd watch every single one I'd watch every single one and I'd love it <laughs> And in almost Marvel tradition, Kate didn't get her name, but she got her name at the end of the episode. You know, they, they didn't say it. It just cuts to Hawkeye after Clint has the idea of, you know, I've got a name for you. And it cuts to Hawkeye. I think she's earned it. I think she deserves it. And I think Clint does too. That was the whole point. I absolutely adored Kate. And I think a lot of people will. So I cannot wait to see her take on the mantle fully as Hawkeye. And like I said, team up with Elena for a, a show or some or a movie, something, just so we can see that interaction, see her stand on her own and call on Clint only when he's needed. Yeah, but like I was saying at the beginning, this show is far better than I was expecting. It is, it just, it just tickled me the right way. I, I don't know how to put it into words hardly. It was like, this is what I needed during the holiday season. It's, it's like Die Hard. It's a Christmas movie. It shouldn't be, but it's a Christmas movie. And that's where this falls for me. I see myself watching this every Christmas. It's comfort watching when it's cold outside, get a glass of hot cocoa, put, pull up the covers and watch some Hawkeye. I, I could absolutely see me doing that next year. It just sounds, ah, it's just so good. I could talk about this show for hours, but I will let you comment now. <laughs> what were your thoughts on the episode? What are you thinking about Kingpin and his, uh, quasi powers we'll say oh, and are you excited for echo maybe you're very different from me where i'm just kind of very lukewarm at best on it but maybe you're super excited so let me know your thoughts in the comments below if you enjoyed this video please hit like and subscribe to see more content like this it really helps the channel out and it just lets me make more content for you guys all right and before i go please take care of yourselves and please have a happy holiday, however you're spending it. Thanks for watching.